Hey everybody, what's happening? Sam with the Thrifty Brewer coming at you. Oh, man, I'm feeling accomplished. Another episode of Brewshed Chronicles. Let's get to crack a lacking, shall we? It's drywall on time. So last night, I got a little adventurous. I uh, went to the old Home Depot, picked up three sheets of this half-inch mold-resistant drywall. And I got one sheet up, not without its problems, though. I mean, if you could have heard the swearing. I didn't even bother to record it because I knew it was going to be bad. It's going to be very, very bad. The missus and I, um, oh, what a nightmare. I got it up, got one up. And then it fell down, broke a beer glass, like just an absolute comedy of errors. But we got the first sheet up and that was the worst one. Because the next one is actually gonna be the full four feet wide. It's gonna go right up there. And you can tell I've decided on lights with the missus's help. We're gonna use these little funky little pot lights, LED pot lights, the nickel finish for classiness. We're gonna have one there. And the nice thing is these are gimbaled, so you can uh, you can move them and direct the beam where you want to go. So we're gonna have one there that's gonna be pointed towards the door. Then we're gonna have another one here that's gonna be pointed either to this wall or that wall. And I did hook them up initially and did try them out in the dark and they give off more than enough light. And the cool thing is is that they're dimmable which is really sweet. So if you want to set the ambiance, you can turn the lights way down low and get your, you know, whatever it is on. <laughs> so now what we're going to do, we're going to uh, take some measurements. We're going to cut, uh, obviously, a small hole for that, a small hole for that, and then I need to be able to fish the wires through. So I really, really, really hope I get my measurements right because if I don't, it's going to be a right mess. We got the holes measured and cut. We got that one for this one here, and that one for this one here. And hopefully, hopefully, I've got things lined up. Got our dead man in place. I'm not gonna film this because I'm gonna swear like a trucker, guaranteed. Now, well, without further ado, let's get this second piece up, and we will uh, we'll go from there. It's gonna be sketchy. <laughs> well, it actually didn't go too poorly. I got it up. The drywall, that is. Oh, and the holes lined up. Holy smokes! But man, it's so awkward doing it by yourself. It's so awkward because these are just like gross awkward and too big to handle so now what we're gonna do we're gonna hook up some lady poos because now we can we're gonna just run a line of uh drywall screws through the center there got all secure but yeah this is coming along great and it's actually already quieter in here which is really really nice and then we'll get some tape and we'll tape up our seams won't mud yet I'm not gonna mud yet we're gonna mud uh when i get everything drywall basically I'm having a really amazing pale ale from a company called uh, Redline Brewing in Barrie, which is like about an hour south. I mean, it's called Clutch. And this is just like, whew, 4.8 ABV. And it is, drinks awesome. The nice thing is, is that you can have a couple of these while you're doing this, because now that the critical measurements are over, it won't be too, too bad. You just have to move everything from there over to this side, and then put that sheet up. And then focus on piecing in up there, which will be nowhere near as bad as handling these big buggers. But yeah, it's coming along. Coming along. Okay, so we got our lights in. The holes lined up. Oh, we got one there pointing this way down to the ground. We got one there pointing that way to the ground. So it doesn't look like a lot, but these LEDs throw off a crap ton of light. So this is going to be awesome. 
Now the next step is to get the last piece in there. <sighs> this is going to be a treat. And it's currently raining outside, which is makes me very, very happy that I bought all the drywall yesterday when I got up before I got home after I got home from work. Because I'm loading drywall when it's wet. Sucks big potatoes. Big potatoes. Alright. Oh, oh my goodness. Okay, so the last piece is up. Well, last big piece. What do you think, Sarah? It's cool. Can I do this? Yeah, go ahead. They go up. They go off too. Oh, cool. That's cool. Small things. And these what? Beautiful minds. So Sarah, what do we gotta do next? Uh, look up. Look above your head. Don't look into the light. Don't look into the light. So I finish off this piece here. here and, and then what's next? Heating, well, no, we got some time. It's not cold. What are it's you talking about? Here. It's like 16 degrees. You know why it's cold? Because it means the insulation is working in the ceiling. Water just splashed me in the face. Oh, my goodness gracious. Water just splashed me in the face, ladies and gentlemen. Water just splashed Sarah in the face. Oh, my goodness. And she's gone. Hair in the wee backs. No, just wait. I will get it down. Little monkeys. Little monkeys indeed. Back in a bit, everybody. Cheers. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Life is good. I'm a lucky man. Cheers. Oh. What a day. I actually turned it into two days. Hey, everybody, we're back and we're done. The ceiling is done. Ceiling is done. Are the lights in? And I've got everything taped up. And then I'm going to mud the ceiling when I get the rest of the walls done. But yeah. Good weeks. Good weekends worth of work. And I'm feeling pretty damn good about it. Pretty damn good. Uh, yeah. Anyways, you guys. It's the same as the 30 Brewers. And I'm going to do something to do with the homebrew. Now, if this is one of your... If this is your first time checking out one of my videos, I encourage you to subscribe. I do a video like this every Wednesday. And every Saturday. <sighs> I do read every single comment. And most importantly, I do reply to them as time permits. This is Sammy the Thrifty Brewer saying, I'm feeling good. Life is good. Life is very good indeed. Anyways, you guys, thanks for watching. Take care. Most importantly, please be safe. Cheers. Thanks again. <laughs>